Good morning, class. How are you? Sit down, please. As you know, we are going to study the lesson that is called Science and Elementary Technology. In Science and Elementary Technology, who can remind us the lesson that we studied last days? Who can tell us the lesson that we studied? in science and elementary technology. Remind us what we studied in science and elementary technology. Uh -huh. You stand up. OK, tell us. Good. In the previous lessons, we studied the mammals or the Animals, are we together? Yes. Okay. I want you to observe here. Are you observing those animals? Yes. Okay. I want you to name this animal. Who can tell us the name of this animal? Horror, tell us. What is this? Rabbit. This one is rat. You repeat all of them. Rat. Good. As Aurora have just said, this is a rabbit. Okay. Are you observing this animal? Who can tell us the name of this animal? Tell us the name of this animal. Adolf, stand up. This is a cow. cow. All of them we repeat. This is cow. Good. As Adolf have just said, that is a cow. We are here. Who can tell us the name of this animal? The name of this animal. Uh huh. Tell us. Good. Okay. This one is a cow. All of them we repeat. This is. Good. Good. This is a goat. Okay, let's pronounce all these animals. All of them. This is a Daddy. And this is a Daddy. This is a Daddy. Good. Let's observe the other animals here. I think you know them. Okay, we have the animals there. Are you seeing all those animals? Yes. Okay, who can name this animal? Fish, fish, fish. Tell us the name fish, of fish, this fish, animal. Fish, 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 fish. tell us. Snake. Repeat. Snake. All of them, you repeat. That one is a? Snake. Good. This is a snake. Thank you very much. This is a snake. All of them repeat. Snake. Good, we are here. Who can give us the name of this animal? Who can give us the name of this animal? Uh huh. Stand up. Frog. This is a frog. Very good. I want you to pronounce all the class. This is a frog. Thank you very much. We are here. Who can give us the name of this animal? Give us the name of this animal. Uh huh, Fabrice. Mm -hmm. The name of this animal? That is a bed. Good. This is a bed. Thank you very much. Okay, let's pronounce all these three animals. This is snake. This is frog. This is snake. Good. 
Then, you have just observed that the animals on the paper B and the animals on the paper A. Who can tell us the difference that is between the animals on the paper A and the animals on the paper B? What is the difference from this animal on these animals? Who can give us the difference that is between those three animals and these three animals? Who can give us the difference there? Haji Kumi, and this one, this one. Try to give us the answer in English. In English, please. Okay, who can help Jikumi? Who can help Jikumi? Uh -huh, Aurora. Because on the paper A uh -huh. is with the animals and and the paper B is domestic animals. Thank you very much. A clap for Aurora. Aurora have just said the animals on the paper A are weird animals. The animals on the paper A are weird animals. But the animals on the paper B are domestic animals. Are we together? Yes. What is a weird animals and what is a domestic animals? Where do weird animals live? Where do weird animals live? Who can tell us where do, do weird animals live? Weird animals is Where do weird animals live? Ah, Laisa. Forest. Crap for Raisa, please. As Raisa said, we the animals live in the forest. Raisa said that we the animals live in the forest. Okay, who can give us any one example of an animal that lives in the forest? Any one animal that you know, and that animal lives in the forest. Uh huh. Thank you very much. Ryan is a weird animal because it lives in the forest. Another example of a weird animal. Uh -huh, Brahme. Dog. Dog. Thank you, Brahme. Please, but dog, you have to know, some dogs may live at home, and the other dogs may live in the forest. Do you know? Sometimes we meet dogs at home. But sometimes we meet the dogs in the forest. But saying that dogs are weird animal, that is correct. It's quite amazing. Harjitza sanga dogs imga ziba mugasozi changwa ziba hehe murugo. Nibiba murugo isabari domestic. Nibiba mugasozi isabari weird. Good. Another example of weird animal. Zebra. Zebra. Good. Now, domestic animals. Where do domestic animals live? Where do domestic animals live? Where do domestic animals live? Pig. A pig is a domestic animal. But my question, where do domestic animals live? Where do domestic animals live? Who can help the colleague? Where do domestic animals live? Where do domestic animals live? Home. Clap for our colleague, please. Clap for her. The domestic animals live at home. Are we together? While weird animals live in the forest, the domestic animals live at home. Example of domestic. The colleague have said that among the domestic animals you have cow. Who can give us another example? Another example of domestic animals. You stand up. Sheep. Speak louder. Sheep. Good. 
Sheep is a domestic animals. Are we together? Yes. Are we together? Yes. Okay. That is a lesson that we have studied in the previous grade and you have just memorized them. Okay, I have another thing that I want you to observe, please. Okay, observe the chart there. This is an animal. True or false? True. true. Is it true or false? True. It's true. A person, a human being is an animal. Are we together? Yes. This is an animal. True or false? True. Good. This is an animal and this is an animal. Now, which difference is between this animal and this animal? Which difference are you seeing between this animal and this animal? No matter, this animal and this one, they are different. Which difference is between these two animals? Who can tell us the difference that is there? Okay, Fabrice, stand up. Mm -hmm. Which difference is there? A person has a backbone and any, an insect doesn't have a backbone. Very good. This one is a person, this is an insect. A person have who? All of them. A person have who? Wow. Thank you very much. And an insect does not have pack of bones. Are you seeing that? Are you seeing that? The person have back bones, but the insect does not have back bones. How do we call the animals that have back bones? How do we call in general all of the animals that have back bones? How do we call all of the animals that have back bones? Okay, tell us, how do we call the animals that have back bones? Cow. That is an example. That is an example. I want the name that is given to all the animals that have back bones. Okay, who can help her? Who can help her? How do you call the animals that you studied that reason in P2, I think? Okay, Fabrice, help her. Invertebrate. Clap for Fabrice, please. All of the animals that have a bones are called vertebrate. Repeat. Vertebrate. Vertebrate animals. Repeat again. Vertebrate animals. That means all animals that have a bones is called vertebrate. A cow. Does a cow have a bones? Yes. Cow is a vertebrate. Goat. Does goat have back bones? Yes. That means goat is a vertebrate. Who can give us another example of vertebrate animal? Apart from cow and goat. Uh-huh. Cynthia? Pig. Thank you very much. Pig is a vertebrate animal. Nadia, you give us your example. Sheep. Sheep. Good. Now, how do we call? All the animals that do not have back bones. We have different animals that do not have back bones. How are those animals that do not have back bones called? Ah, you stand up. Oh, how do those animals that do not have back bones called? Invertebrate. Clap for the colleague, please. Clap. Clap. All the animals that do not have back bones are called. Invertebrate animals. You repeat. Invertebrate animals. Repeat again. Invertebrate animals. That means all the animals that do not have a back on bones are called invertebrate animals. Give us anyone example of invertebrate animals. Example of invertebrate animal. Flower. Is a flower an animal? No. Is a flower an animal? No. Okay, who can help him? Who can help him? Uh-huh, you stand up. Uh-huh. B. What? 
B. B. Good. B is invertebrate animals. Who can explain as B in Kinyarwanda? What is a B in Kinyarwanda? What is a B in Kinyarwanda? Uh huh. Kinyarwanda is isaz. Is a B isaz? Uh huh. Who can help Bram? Who can help Bram? Uh huh. You stand up. Uh -huh. Good. B in Kinyarwanda is Uruyuchi. Are we together? And B is invertebrate animal because it does not have baka bones. The colleague have just said the flower. What is the flower in Kinyarwanda? Flower in Kinyarwanda. In Kinyarwanda mm -hmm. is it? is Isas. Let me help him. Isas in English is he? fly or house fly. Flower in Kinyarwanda is he? Uru. Rabo. Orurabo is not an animal. Are we together? Yes. Okay. Okay, another example of invertebrate animal we have to say mosquito. It is C. Are we together? Okay, you have studied those ones in the previous grade, I think. You're remembering them. Then, we are going to go outside. There is what you are going to observing outside. But before going there, I want to ask you a question. You studied those vertebrate animals, and the teacher told you that the vertebrate animals are in different classes. Is it okay? Who can give us anyone a class of vertebrate animal? Anyone a class that you have studied in vertebrate animal? The vertebrate animal are in different classes or types. Who can give us any one group of vertebrate animals? Fabrice? Reptile. Good. Reptile are vertebrate animals. In Kinyarwanda, reptile is Ibikuru Randa. Give us an example of reptile. Raisa? Reason is a reptile. Clap for Raisa, please. Clap for Raisa. Good. Another group of vertebrate animal, apart from reptile, who can give us another type of reptile that you know? Another group, another class of vertebrate animal. Uh -huh, Aurora? Amphibian. Amphibians. Thank you very much, Aurora. Who can give us an example of amphibians? Example of amphibians. Frog, good. Another group of vertebrates, apart from reptile, amphibians. Who can give us another group of vertebrates? Huh? Birds. Birds or birds. Who can give us an example of birds that you know? That's all right. Hen. Hen. Thank you very much. Another group of vertebrate animal, as you studied them. Uh huh. Uh huh. Fish. Fish. Who can give us an example of fish? An example of fish. Because the fish are in different types. Uh -huh. give, give us an example. Why? Well, yes, it's well. Okay, another group of um, vertebrates that you know. Another group of vertebrates that you know. Another group of vertebrates that you have studied. Uh -huh, Fabrice. We have said the reptile, amphibians, bird, fish, what else? Mamo. Mamo, clap for Fabrice Breeze. Okay, all of them, will you repeat, Mamo? Mamo! Again. Mamo! That group of vertebrates, that is called Mamo. That is called mammals or mammals. We want to study them now. That is a lesson that we want to study. Are we together? Yes. We want to insist on the mammals just now. Are we together? Yes. Okay. Please, quietly, I want you to pass outside. Who can give us the name of this animal? Please, please. Who can name this animal? Uh-huh. This one is it? Goat. 
Is a goat a mammal? Yes. Yes, goat is a mammal. Yes. Now, we want to focus about the external part of a mammal. The external part of a mammal. The part of a mammal that you can see by using our eyes externally. Who can tell us anyone external part of this head? Ah, uh, you girl? The mammal here, they have other. It has what? Other. Who can show us the other on this, on this goat? Where is the other? Uh -huh. Go and show us where is the other. Okay, the other is there. Ni kinyarwanda other is what? Amabere. Good. That means the among the different external part of mammo, we have other. Who can tell us anyone part of external part of mammo? We have other. What else? Speak louder. Leg. The mammo has legs. Good. Who can show us the leg of this mammo? Who can show us the leg of this mammo? Uh -huh. You come, Nadia, and speak louder. Speak louder. Leg. Good. The legs are those one. Another external part of this mammo. Uh -huh. Brahme. We have just said the other. We have said the leg. What else? Uh -huh, Thierry. Mouth. The mammo has what? Mouth. Are we together? Or the head in general? Are we together? It has the other. It has legs. It has mouth. What else? What else? Come here. What? Abdomen. It has abdomen. It has head. It has a tail. Are we together? Yes. Are we together? Yes. Okay, who can all of them tell us anyone external part of mammo? One is all of them? Horse. Horse. Anyone external part of this mammo have said? One have said what? One is Red. all of them? Red. Legs. What else? One is leg. What else? What else all of them? Abdomen. Abdomen. Repeat. Abdomen. What else? Abdomen. We have legs. We have abdomen. Who can tell us another part? Horn. It has a horn. Yes, I'm a hembe. It has a and, But let's insist about the other. How together? Mamo yo, si kisa iku giza ifitichi. Other. That is the main external part of mammals. Any mammals is supposed to have what? In, in English, all of them are supposed to have what? That is the general, the main external part of mammals. Now, we want to go in the classroom, but slowly. Let's go in the classroom, but slowly. Please, I don't want you to make a noise. This is a goat. Are we together? Yes. What is this? Repeat. We have just commented about the external, external part of mammals. How did we call this external part of mammal of a goat? How did we call this external part? Okay, Cynthia, stand up. Clap for Cynthia, please. We say that this one is the other. Are we together? And we said this is the main external part of mammals. Are we together? Any mammal is supposed to have other. Are we together? How do we call this external parts? 
How did we call that external part? Adolfe, you stand up. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. We said that those ones are called legs. Good. How did we call um, this part of Umamo? That part of Umamo? Uh huh. You stand up. Mouth. That one is called the <coughs> mouth. And how did we call this one? Rore. Mm -hmm. This is the tail. Thank you very much. This one is the tail. Those are the four external parts of mammal. The mammals, they have many parts. But let's let stop by that, those four. But the main one have said that is the Ada. Please, even the other classes of vertebrates, nizin the classes Zajira Maguru, Zajiru Munwa, Zajiru Murizo, I can have Zajirichi, Amaver. If we go, it is simple to do a sang and Amaver, it is a very ma mo. Good. Okay. Those one was internal, but the external, there are the internal too. Let help me and observe here. These are external. External name in Utrava Kuchi and Hukucho Gusakutu Chimanachi Jenda. But internal are the, the part that are inside. Are we together? Internal part of mammals in Chevy in Bedino Mujisim. External, Virinuma. Internal, they are inside. Now, this is a cow. Is a cow a mammal? Yes or not? Yes. Good. Cow is a mammal. And it has this inside part that we may call internal, internal parts of mammals. Internal parts of mammals. Are we together? OK. Who can tell us anyone part that he's saying there into the cow? Anyone internal part of that cow? Who can tell us anyone part that he's saying there? It have many parts that are in, inside, but who can tell us anyone internal part of that cow? Uh huh. In that cow, there is a river. Who can you go and touch on a river? Who can you go and touch on a river in that cow? Cynthia, come. Come and touch. It's touching you only. Come and touch on that on the river. Uh huh. The river, it's that one that have green, not red. The river is here. This one is a river. Are you seeing? Yes. That means river is the internal part of mammals. Repeat. River. Again. River. River in Kenya Rwanda is it? Yes. It's a kind of, mam of a muscle that is inside the animals. Okay. This river is internal part of mama. Who can give us another internal part there? Laisa, come. Small intestine. Good. Who can come and touch on the small intestine on that cow there? Come and show us the small intestine. Nadia, come. Good. The small intestine is here. Thank you very much, Nadia. That means among the different internal parts, we have just seen what we call river, two is small intestine. Repeat. Small intestine. Come again. Small intestine. And here is river. All of them. River. Here. 
another internal part of that cow, please. Okay, tell us. Please come. Go and show us. Oh, stand up and tell us, please. Is the other internal? Other is outside. Tell us anyone external. Uh -huh. Stand up. Red intestine. Who can help him? Okay, help him. Large intestine. Repeat. Large intestine. Stand up. You repeat. All of them. This one is a large intestine. Small intestine and large intestine. Are we together? This is small And this is large intestine. Here. Okay, the next, please. Let me tell you. This one that is near the liver is called the heart. heart. Repeat. Heart. That means among the different internal parts of mammals, we have seen what we call heart. what we call uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Heart. Thank you very much. Then. We have just seen the internal part, internal part and the external part of mammals. Are we together? Yes. Now, I want you to take your exercises in your book. Okay, please, please. Finish. We have the four animals here. This one is he? Look at here, please. Look at here. This is? This is? This is? This is? I want you to select only mammals. Among these animals, there are mammals and those ones which are not mammals. You write only mammals. All the mammals which are in the paper, you write only the mammals which are there. Okay, I want you now to do this action. Pens down. I want you to sit in groups. Discuss your colleague, Mugane Kusubzo Mabonye. Now, we want you to write here on the mammals. Okay, wait. Let's start with this group. Pig. pig. Is a pig a mammal or not? Others. Are you agree with this group? Is a pig a mammal? Good. Pig is a mammal. Thank you very much. Let's use the next group. You tell us another mammal that is there. Hen. Hen. The other group, are you agree with it? Is a hen a mammal? No. Hen is not a mammal. Hen is not a mammal. Let's continue with this group. Okay, you give us an example of a mammal here. Pig, it was said. Cow. There is no cow there. There is no cow there. Let's go here. Huh? Okay. That means the mammals are those two only. Are we together? Yes. There is not another mammal there. Are we together? Among these four animals, the mammals are pig and person. Is a fish a mammal? No. 
No. Is a hen a mammal? No. No. Pig a mammal? Yes. yes. Person is a mammal? Yes. yes. That means we have two mammals. Those one who have just got, those one they have just done. Are we together? Now we are going to do exercises. I want you to write. N3 mammals. You give N3 examples of mammal. I want you to match the wrists. We have wrist A and wrist B. Okay, please pens down. Pens down. Pens down. Pens down. That's on the chalkboard. You write any three mammals. Who can give us the example of mammal? Any one example of mammal? Uh -huh. Wait. Example of mammal? Big. Repeat. Big. She's saying big. How, who can help her in the pronunciation? Can you help her? Pig. Pig, you repeat. Stand up. Again. Again. All of them. Go and write pig on the chalkboard. Here. Pronounce again. Again. You repeat. Good. This one is a pig. Who can give us another example of mammal? Uh -huh. Sheep. Sheep. Is it okay? No. Is a sheep a mammal? No. What is a sheep in Kenya Rwanda? What is a sheep in Kenya Rwanda? In Ham. Does a sheep have other? Does the sheep have other? Yes. 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 Who has a sheep at home? In the over 15 Hamamurugu. Okay. Try and accompany the colleagues. You will see that the sheep at home they have other. That means it is a mammal. Then, sheep is a mammal. Another example of a mammal. Another example of a mammal. Uh -huh. Stand up. Hmm? Person. Thank you very much. A person is a mammal. Are we together? Yes. Person is a mammal. Now, matching the wrist. Is the other internal or external part? Is the other internal or external part? Nadia, is the other internal or external part? External parts. Other is external parts. Good. Legs are external parts. Go and match. Legs and external parts. Be quick. You match legs and the external parts. Thank you very much. Small intestine. Internal or external part? Testing internal part. Easy internal parts. Go on the match. Go do. Now. Is the large intestine internal or external parts? Internal parts. 
Good. Large intestine is internal parts. Come and match that one. Go and match. Good. Large intestine is the internal parts. Good. Okay. It's a time for taking notes.